Dr. Xu asked me to use my the relative for license temporal control. I think most of the people know already because I published one review paper about the application of a vetiver for rice temple control. So maybe so many people know this already. And also Mr. Wang also introduced uh, some result and also how to work in China already. So I can believe my talk. So I think uh, you can learn more about the uh, control strategies and uh, technology. In China, we have three main insect pests. First the one is Stambola. Stambola has two species, striped Stambola and the pink Stambola. And those are another two things, uh, one is the plant hoppers and the leaf folders. But leaf folders and the plant hoppers cannot overwinter. And also only migrate from Southeast Asia, especially from Vietnam, Thailand, Thailand to China, then to our place, uh, Yang Zi Delta. So you can see the uh, damage of the sample for rice. Rice sample out of break because of higher resistance to insect size. You can see the damage symptoms. And this year we have Stambola in our province. So because the Stambola has, has developed higher resistance to the insect size. Another way uh, design is higher larva su su survivors in winter season. You can see larva and uh, soil. So the very higher survivor in the recent years. So this is why, because the, this is because of the global warming. I think most of the place in the world also the same. This is a global warming is a big problem in the world. So also for the Stambola can survive well during winter season in also China. So you can, we find the resistant to the dominant insect size, especially for the Amidus. For the Colometis poor, you can see the control FEC in the 2008. We used the new component uh, insect size in the 2008. So you can find a very higher control efficiency. But five years later, in 2013, so the control efficient uh, is only less than 16%. In also the in 19, 1916, the country efficient only 20%. Even though pharma use double dose. So pharma think how to control Stambola? Because we use the uh, pesticide, but the country efficient is still very low. Cannot cannot control for control. So we tested the resistance in the 1915 and 1916 and until 1917. You can find that the resistance developed very fast, especially in the Jiang province. The, the population in the Shangshan uh, county, the resistance reach more than 200 times. It's very high for the uh, insect. So pharma cannot control where by chemical. So now you, we continue test the resistant for the different population in the China. You can find the resistant ratio go down because we use many strategies including use the factiva as the control agent. So pharma reduce to use the chemical pesticide. So we can find the resistance go down. This is a very interesting story. In 1998, I visited Thailand 
This is my first time to visit uh, Chiang Mai. I found one picture. This is a uh, Tai King. He teach the taught the farmers how to close fatima for the soil erosion plantation. So one scientist of noise uh, department of Thai Thailand, one of my friend told me the big problem for the fatima is the stem border. So I introduced the fatima to close to the side of the rice, we can find the most damaged by a stem boiler. Very, very heavy. So stem boiler can lay eggs in the, on the vertebral livers. So I test the, I uh, conducted some experiment to, to explain. So we can find in the free choice test, there are more than 78, almost 80% such as the lay acres on the fativa. And less than 20% acres lay on the rice. So it means a doubt of the just the like to lay acres on the fativa for the striped stem So we have another stem boiler, pink stem also the same, almost 62% acres lay on the fativa. So we can find another experiment for the stem boiler, we can find the lava survivor goes down. So until force is done, zero. It means the stem boiler lava cannot survive, cannot finish there. So it means we can close, we can plant the fativa the, around the rice field to control the uh, stem bolus. So for the larva of a stem bolus larva can survive on the rice. Even though the rice, uh, larva also not uh, survive very good, but they can finish their histo rice. For the pink stem bolus, also the same. The larva survivor goes down, goes down up to four insta, but Less than 5% lava can pupate. Pupa can be found in the fativa, but very few, very difficult to find. Such as the Mr. Wong, he showed us they can find some lava in the fativa stem. This is very few because most of the lava killed by the fativa. Why? Because in the fatima plant, the amino size very low. You can see the ratio of the rice to the fatima very high. The con contentment, the amino uh, amino acid in the rice is very high than the just in the fatima. And also, we can find this content of nutrition such as total protein course and the total sugar is very high, significant higher than those in rice. So also we can find the, the toxin, toxin uh, uh, material, the turning is very high in vativa. So it means the, the, uh, the larva feeding, feeding the vativa with the um, so this is affecting the activity of the dilation energy in the body, causing it. So I think that Mr. Wang showed us the result already. So another way is we use the component. We get the, some extract to test the, the lava survivor. So we can find the one component. We just show, we just call them FR1. They are very high uh, to uh, toxin. We call this is the in six side uh, substance. So this is why sedan so cannot survive because the low nutrition and the higher toxin materials. 
So how to plan? So we just plan the sativa on the bound or the road side or the irrigation canal side. So different uh, space, five meter interval, 30 meters interval and one meter interval. So we find the high, uh, high uh, uh, control efficiency. So we decided, we told the farmer, we uh, planting fativa, uh, fativa species in the low, maybe four meat is best way. The different though, uh, Mr. Mr. Uh, Huang showed us already, we set up an experiment, the low species is a five, 10, 15, and 20 meter interval. So we can find almost the same control effect. So it means fativa can control stembola in the field that they are far more close to the uh, fativa in, uh, with the low species of the, at the 20 meters. So this means we have a different species of the rice field. So farmer can close on the bound, but it depends on the size of the field because the farmer cannot close the fativa in the middle of the rice field. Farmer just, just can uh, plant fativa in the low side or bound. So this is a very big limited, uh, limited uh, uh, issues. And also we can control Sudambola by using charcoal grammar, palace toy. And also we also can control Sudambola by the sex pheromone. So how to, it, so we set up a, a, another experiment for treatment, fativa only, fativa plus, plus sex, uh, sex pheromone trap, and then fativa plus chakra glama. Fativa, sex pheromone, and uh, chakra glama. So we can find the different uh, control eff effect. Almost the same, but just only low them chemical spray in the heating stage. In the, at the tillage stage, chemical spray is a much low control effect. effect. So we can find the farmer just only plant the fativa along the rice, plant, rice field. Also, sample also can be controlled well. We made the legal, uh, regulation for the country rice sample in the, our province. This is the regulation. This is a, uh, published already. So we tell the farmer when, how, when planting. So in our province, which is a March, from March to June, farmer can close. So how big space, three or four meters. And also as the farmer using some nutrition for, uh, fertilizer to improve control in fact, so it means if a farmer can use, uh, if a farmer use uh, nutrition, nutrition uh, per, uh, fertilizer, uh, the effect of the fertilizer to control stembola will be increased. So, and also we found some component. We tested the uh, EAG, resistance for the stembola. So we found the different uh, chemical from the fertilizer can attract, attract, attract the uh, male or female very well. So we can find the uh, male very high. And uh, sometimes also uh, female, male. So we use the uh, component, uh, component uh, uh, combinations, make us an illusion to use the trap, the female adult of Stambolas. So this is just a study. Maybe next year I can, uh, provide some um, loge to farmers. This year we tested already, uh, get uh, some result, but uh, this is not good. So maybe next year we can find some new product for the control Sudambolas. This is uh, our review paper, application of a vertical glass as a trap 
plant for rice assembler. We introduced all technology in this paper. You can download in the General Integrated Agriculture published by SFL in 1917. So please download this. You can uh, lead the, you can find the more details in this papers. This is the uh, 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 demonstration area. You can find that we use ecological engineering technology to control Stambola plant hoppers and uh, leaf folders. So this is a similar a sesame to enhance the uh, biological control function. So also from a closer than uh, uh, fativa to control Stambola. You can see along the highway, we use the fativa and uh, load different side. We des designed uh, the experiment. This is very good. A farmer can reduce two or three times uh, pesticide. size. And uh, sometimes if the population of Sudanbola is not so high, farmer can no need to spray, just use the uh, fativa to control Sudanbola well. This is a low side. So we ask the farmer to close the uh, plant space uh, four meters. This technology was introduced by the develop development of agriculture of China uh, central government. We extension this technology in the 15 province. And, uh, uh, and it's accumulated more around the 20, 200,000 uh, hectares of rice used in the in the, in the, uh, in the 15 province in the south area. In North China, we cannot close because the temperature in the winter is too low. So uh, Vativa cannot survive. So just only south area. Thank you.